Hello, art friends. We're going to be drawing Dak Prescott from the Dallas Cowboys. All right, so to start with, I am going to put his head here and have a little body underneath of him because we're gonna draw a caricature of Dak. We're not gonna draw a realistic picture like you see here, but I'm using this picture as a guide. Okay, so to start with, we're gonna draw a line across the top like that. That's his hairline. And then we're gonna draw a line coming down, coming out just a little bit and coming down. Then over here, we're gonna go almost straight down. Well, pretty much straight down like so. All right, then we're gonna have a jawline jawline diagonal and then we're gonna have a, a goatee line and instead of drawing a line I'm just gonna draw some little little goatee is that a beard yeah kind of a beard I'm not a facial hair expert by any means there you go all hairs and then we could you know put some more hairs out here just kind of a suggestion of shadow. All right, then what we're gonna do is draw a little chin line and another line for under the lip. And then we're gonna draw the lip. So to start with, we're gonna draw a little kind of curvy line and it's gonna come across and back up. And that's his bottom lip. And then we're gonna draw a line across Okay, then we're gonna draw a line going across with a little little, little divot there. And then we're gonna draw another line coming across with a little divot there, and that's his bottom of his top lip. And then we're gonna draw a line across the top like that. And then that's gonna kinda go into those lines like so. Then, we're gonna draw some little teeth, just a little. And then we're gonna draw, we're just gonna draw this black in here, okay? So it's kind of black underneath, back in the mouth. Woo, all right, then he's got a little mustachio here, some little side from his grin. He's kind of a smiley guy. And we'll do some little mustachios going this way. There we are. Okay, now for the nose. So the nose is going to be a letter C that comes up, back down, and then another letter C over there. And we're gonna put a little nose line there. Then we're gonna move up from the side of his mouth little bit higher here about there and we're gonna put an arched line right here because he's smiling so his eyes are kind of arched like this and we're gonna put his pupil iris we're just gonna leave a little white spot like so for some shine and then we're gonna draw the eyelid kind of area and then he's got some eyelashes or eyebrows we'll put some texture in those there we go there's one he's peeping at us all right then we're gonna draw a line coming up here and this is gonna be kind of a shadowy line and it's gonna come down and up like that. Then we're gonna draw the same thing. Here's the, the top of his eye. Then we're gonna draw another arched line like that. And we're gonna draw inside here, leaving a little bit of light. Then here come the eyebrows again this side that 
or archy as well because it kind of goes along with the muscles in the face. Ooh, okay, and then we got a few little lines above in the forehead for where he is uh, smiling. Oh my gosh, what are we missing? Oh, that's right, the top of his head. Okay, so we're gonna come down, come down like that, and we're gonna come down, gonna color this in, because he's got some black hair shadows and then we got some ears here so the ears start out at the eyes so we're gonna do kind of a curve it's gonna bump out and then there's his earlobe then we're gonna do some little detail-y things because he's got his hair cut real tight and then here's the other side of his head and this is all black Black up here. Need a big marker for this job. There we go, I'll get that better later. All right, then we're gonna do the same thing. So we're gonna come across, we're gonna come out circle come back in, out, and then another circle at the bottom for his earlobe. And we're gonna do some little, just some little this is and that. Oh, let's see. Do we need anything else? We got you, Dak. Okay. Maybe we'll kind of color this lip in the top lip a little bit darker. The bottom lip is usually lighter. Okay. Now comes the little bitty neck. So we're gonna draw a little bitty neck like that. It's very little. All right, then we are going to draw a line coming out, down, down, and back out. Okay, so these are his shoulder pads. Then we're gonna draw a line going diagonal, back in, like so. And then we've got the lines on the jersey. All right, then we've got an elbow like that. We've got the inside, like so. Then we've got the ball, like that. We'll put a little dot there. Okay, and then we've got the uh, hand just coming around, like so. And then there's the line for the sleeve. <gasps> Halfway there. All right, then we're gonna go to this arm. We're gonna come out, down, like so. And then we're gonna do a little thing there. There's his jersey. And then we've got some lines. There we go. Here's his sleeve. Now this one's a little trickier because he's got his hand out. So we're gonna draw the thumb and we're gonna go down and around and there's the pinky. Here's the finger. We're gonna have these fingers kind of together like that. And then for the um, sleeve, we're just gonna come down and back up because it's foreshortened. Now for the pants. Okay, so here's where the middle is. We're gonna come across. Then here, we're gonna come across and down. And we're gonna make a line. Okay, so these are the pants. And then we've got a little calf kind of curve and a straight line in front. Then we've got the shoes, so he's standing on this foot mostly, coming back up, and then it's gonna dip down and come back up. And then we've got the sock line right there. <gasps> One more leg left. Okay, so this, this leg's coming back, so it's coming diagonal and up for the knee, and then back for the front of the calf. 
then for this part, it's just gonna come straight down to where this knee is. And then we've got a line there and we've got the back of the calf that comes down a little bit further. We have the line of the sock. Then for the shoe, it's gonna come down, go around, come back up, back up, and then it comes down and up. Okay, and there's this little shoe. Woo, and then we got a little bitty kind of logo thing there, and we got the number four, which is gonna start as a triangle. And we're gonna put a line beside the triangle, a little line coming this way, a line coming across, across, down, across, down, down. There we go, there's the number four. And then he's got his uh, V-neck on. And I don't really think we have room for the NFL logo on the top, so I think we'll just skip that. And then we're gonna have a little background. Should we do, uh, let's do some little uh, field lines, yard lines. So we'll make these be thick. And then here's the field goal behind him. Touchdown. Yeah, I think we have a little line coming up here too for the other side of the field goal. Okay, that looks pretty good. And then we can, you know, kind of put a thing here where the side of the field is. And then we've got all the fans screaming in the back. <sighs> go Dak, go. Throw a touchdown, Dak. Don't lose the ball, Dak. A lot of pressure on those QBs. I wouldn't want to be one. Getting clobbered by that lineman. Scary. And put on a couple more lines. Yeah, that looks good. And then we'll put some people in the stands watching him just kind of give a suggestion of people in the stands that paid a lot of money for their tickets. Goodness sakes. How much is it to go to a pro game? Bet it's not cheap. And then buy the food when you're there. Ooh, the lolly. Okay, we'll fill that in with color. Okay, and there we go. Hey, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to Middle School Art Mania. Thanks for watching.